While issuing a statement on uh, the publicity stunt behind Poonam Pandey's death, uh, the PR agency Shabang, which was responsible for orchestrating uh, this entire campaign, has now on its various social media platforms issued an apology. However, they have said that this was a campaign aimed at spreading awareness regarding cervical cancer. In fact, in this very statement that has been issued on their various social media platforms, be it Instagram or for that matter even LinkedIn, uh, they have said that they apologize to those who have had their uh, family members or loved ones lose out to cancer. But they said that their entire campaign was aimed towards propagating or for that matter raising awareness regarding cervical cancer in many ways. Uh, in this very post, they've also said that, that though many do not really know, uh, but for that matter, Poonam Pandey's mother had bravely fought cancer, and which is why, considering the fact that she has, uh, uh, she's understood cancer through her family itself, which is where it was Poonam Pandey who was chosen uh, to be the face for this uh, very uh, gimmick. However, uh, this very uh, this very gimmick of Poonam Pandey has not really gone well with people on social media who have questioned the fact that how could she uh, really play with emotions or uh, you know use death as as an example or uh, for a publicity stunt. Uh, many people have in fact questioned the, this very stance taken by Poonam Pandey. So far in Mumbai, there have been um, there have been three complaints which have been filed at various locations. A recent one being by a social media influencer as well who said that for this very publicity stunt of Poonam Pandey, there should be an FIR that should be registered against her. Uh, taking back to what this entire incident was, on Friday, uh, the social media team of Poonam Pandey had on her Instagram account posted that she had uh, she had bravely fought uh, cervical cancer and considering it was in the last stage of detection, she uh, she lost her life to cervical cancer. However, just a day later, on Saturday, uh, Poonam Pandey went live to various of her social media handles stating that she was alive, she had not lost her life uh, to cancer, but she said that that was not true for various other hundreds and thousands of girls who had lost life uh, to cervical cancer. And she said that she had in fact pulled off this uh, very social media post or stunt just uh, so that she could raise awareness regarding uh, cervical cancer. After breast cancer, cervical cancer is among the uh, second most detected cancer where uh, where girls lose their life. There, in 2020, so far, there were 77 a uh, thousand girls who'd lost their life to cervical cancer. More than 1,28,000 cases of cervical cancer were detected in the year 2020. Uh, this was the kind of stance that was put forth even in the social media post shop by Poonam Pandey as well as the social media agency. However, what needs to be uh, seen in this very case is the fact that uh, uh, this very social media stunt has not very really gone well with people on social media who, though understood that it is uh, it is a cause that needs to be spoken about, did not really empathize with the fact that. Uh, someone can uh, someone cannot be sensitive towards the feelings of uh, of the families who are uh, battling cancer. Uh, in fact, this entire uh, this entire campaign, the PR campaign, had come in just a day after Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman had in her budget speech mentioned about cervical cancer, when she said that the government is working on measures where uh, there should be a vaccine, HPV vaccine, that should be given to girls between the age of nine to fourteen. In, uh, and which is where just a day later we saw Poonam Pandey, uh, Poonam Pandey social media post uh, saying that uh, uh, she was dead. Uh, in fact, later on in the very video that she posted on a Saturday, she also happened to mention that uh, there was cervical cancer was preventable with, uh, with HPV vaccine, which was she had uh, she had pulled off uh, this very social media post just to raise awareness about the HPV vaccine.